Well. We'll mark all your agents to, uh, Dishonored. Pacifist run. Now... Can I crawl under this? No, of course not. Now, where we left off is, uh... I kind of used up a lot of sleep, a lot of bunch of sleep darts, and uh, there was a bunch up here. Yeah, definitely wasted them. But I'm trying to not kill anyone this run, just to say I did it, basically. Yeah, and then after this run, I'm gonna do the kill everything run. First of all, drink this. Wrong button. Corvo, wake up! Eh. You were making funny faces Five while more you were minutes. sleeping. I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking her bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. Okay. Um. You should head back to your room. I like it up here. I mean, the old tower's haunted. I've even seen a ghost once. He had. Weird black eyes. Oh, that's my friend. Mm, all right, I'll go. All right. Attention, Dunwall. I guess we're gonna go to Sokolov real quick. The circle has chosen to take place with. Us. This is a drawing of you with out your scary mask. Well, that's nice. Some Pendleton stuff. The renovation Did you do of Caldwin's no. Bridge will be interesting. I know it looks. I was inventing a new kind of lock. The tumblers, shaped like. Snowflakes. Okay. The truth is, there is no snowflake lock. I was just, you know, looking through the lock. Why? Were you, were you spying on someone? I'd rather you didn't spy on people here, especially since we're planning on like a, a type of revolution. I couldn't bear it if she knew. I know you're a man of honor, and I also know that you can kill me at any time. And for both of these reasons, I apologize <laughs> and beg for your discretion. All right, I'll let you off the hook this time. You got something to say? The High Overseer is supposed to be the most pious man in the Empire. Living completely in alignment with the Seven Strictures and guiding the people in the religious faction towards spiritual health. Campbell was a farce. If not for all the blackmail material he accumulated, he'd have never been more than a lower level initiate among Overseers. Interesting. I wonder, can I... Does she live up there? All the way up there, or just like one of the rooms? There has to be something special up there. I'm gonna go check that real quick. I fell. Ha! Fine. I need as much money as possible. Dear Uncle, it's been a while since I've heard from you, and the way things are going, I can't be sure we'll see each other again. I just wanted to tell you I'm doing well, and I'm safe, for now. My job, caring for a young girl, is better than I expected, though she can be very trying. But I'm treated well. There is enough to eat. I fare better than most, I suppose. We are the last of them. Where are you staring at? We just have to go on living, if we can. May we see each other soon. Your niece, Callista. Just 
She's admiring the view. Alright, carry on. I'm gonna go, uh, check on Sokolov. I hope Sokolov will cooperate. I'd hope to have him paint my portrait again one day. Just me this time. Okay. Hey, Sokolov. Royal physician. I believe you and Corvo knew each other in former days. Unlike you, our friend Corvo knows what loyalty means. Bah! I am loyal to my inner spirit. You are the one consorting with the most wanted man in the Empire. It's my belief that Corvo was innocent in the death of the Empress. And the former spy master, or the Lord Regent, as he calls himself, is a ruthless tyrant bent on destroying the city, the heart of the Empire. You are mistaken if you think there's love between me and our Lord Regent. Then are you going to join us? Whatever you intend to do here, I assure you, I am beyond petty scare tactics. If I don't scare you, Sokolov, perhaps these rats will. <laughs> Even if they don't carry clay, I've heard of a swarm of rats stripping a child's body to the bone in half a minute. I've heard worse. How long do you think it'll be before you talk? Before you beg to talk? Rats? Is that the company you keep now, Admiral? It's the ah, company least them, I guess. that interests us so well. We know you painted a portrait of the Lord Regent's mistress. The very aristocrat who is funding the military with her fortune. She is the key to the Lord Regent's control over the city, and we must have her name. Sorry, Admiral. I cannot help you. I let me try. You are part of this rabble, but I know you have your reasons. Yes, he does. All we need is the name of the Lord Regent's mistress. It's very simple. I elect not to tell you. You will have to force the words from me, and I warn you, my willpower is quite legendary. Oh, really? I'm guessing money will probably work for you. Perhaps a bribe. A curious strategy. Of which I approve. Huh. So, okay, I have to go ask Hiro to give you the money. All right. I'll leave it to you. But if you get tired of questioning, it's okay. Hiro, you got the money? It's well known that Sokolov is virtually addicted to a rare liquor called King Street Brandy. The taste is revolting, but I happen to have a bottle. However... I am reluctant to give it to you for Sokolov. It cost me quite a lot. It is very expensive stuff, a blend of rare Pendician spices and a drop of whale oil. Would you care to purchase it? I guess. I'm trying not to harm them. And uh, he'll be a potential ally. Oh. You also got me some blueprints. So that's actually pretty cheap. That would be more. All right, there's 150. No. I found the bottle. Is this enough? King Street brandy. I didn't know any more like existed. That. Is an extraordinary gift. I see I'm dealing with men of taste. I can tell you this much. She was always referred to as Lady Boyle. I painted her to be sure, but I never saw her face or learned her first name. You see, I painted her from behind. I assure you, she still makes a striking portrait. But I do not know which Boyle she is. Oh. I was to be introduced to her at a masked ball in her honor this very night. But I will miss that party, it seems. A masked ball at the Boyle estate. Tonight, the timing is perfect, Corvo. But the Boyles are wealthy and ruthless, so security will be very tight. Of course, you already have a mask, yeah. don't you, Corvo? He's right. I guess it could work. You will be able to mingle with him once you're on the ground. We'll have to find out which of the Boyle women is connected to the Lord Regent and take her out in whatever way you can devise. We're very close now. If you do this tonight, you'll be able to strike at the Lord Regent himself 
and put Emily on the throne. May the wind favor you. All right, let's do this. I hear you're off to the boils little bash yeah. tonight. I have just a tiny favor I'd like to ask you. Could you give this note to Lord Shaw? Okay. You'll know him. A rather brusque man wearing a wolf's mask. In fact, he may be looking for me. I knew Sokolov would see reason. Over a note. Page. Okay. He never actually liked the Lord. Guess we're going. Ah. Ready? The boil costume ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. You ready? Yep, there's not really much else. Great. The Lord Regent's pulling out all the stops for the Boyle family. I didn't think there'd be tall boys patrolling here tonight. Watch tall yourself, Corvo. They don't fool around. The good news is, once you get to the party, that mask of yours will let you blend right in. Enjoy your evening out. Oh, I see. They're quality. eradicating the... Better you than me. Infected. That was interesting. All right, I need to get into the party without being detected by that guy. Because there's no way I'm going to be able to take him out without killing him. Unauthorized intruders will be expelled or apprehended on site. Stealth. Anything in here? Ooh, coin. <clears throat> hmm. Interesting. Huh? What have you seen? Guard! What enough? For me! Um, nope. Ow. Thanks for the money. Somebody, please help. I did. Should be safe now. You okay? Help! I need a hand here. Somebody, please. Okay, then. See you guy. Or good night. Oh safe and sorry. Sorry about this. Ooh, what's in here? Might be something special in here. I could probably use these. I could probably use the weepers to uh, distract them. To uh, have the guards fight the weepers and then I could just pass them all, right? Should be that simple. Way. He doesn't live here anymore. Who doesn't live? Oh, it's this guy. Ah, I feel bad. I have to use that. Alright, thanks for the money. Thanks for the drink. 
Let's bring out the possession because that's my easiest way of taking them. Going to a party, Corvo? Yeah? Is that what you dreamed of? All those months in Cold Ridge Prison while waiting for the executioner? Well, beautiful women in the latest fashion, laughing and drinking Tivian wine. And what of the host, Lady Boyle? I can see all her tomorrows, and I know that either she dies tonight at your hand, or she'll live out her days, month after month, year after year, far away, even as her fine clothes wear into tatters and her silken hair gets dull and gray. Half the city can see the lights from the party, and they dream of the delights inside. Will you tear it all to pieces? Either way, it's Lady Boyle's last party. So what you're saying is I'm guaranteed to the success, but I'm running away from... Good night. One charm. Falling star. What does this one do? Ah, I can't. Next run I'm doing is definitely a kill everyone run. I have no choice but to use sleep darts on these guys, sadly. Is there any sleep darts in here? Some more money. Alright, switch out the possession. Okay then, I teleported straight into a wall. Hmm. Spot more weepers over there. It's not like you have an easy time taking them out. Let me just. Yeah, Alright, I see them. I'm not surprised. I've heard stories. But she won't talk about it. One of these days I'm gonna take one of those zealots apart myself. I'll be right behind you. Like I said. Let's get out of the possession. What are you doing? Big guy killed it already. Oh, yes. ah. Bye, Dave. Take you all the way back here if you uh, don't mind. Good night. people. Oh, yes. <coughs> Take you out real quick. I am not letting you die. I'm going to need you for later. That's definitely enough rats to kill you.
I'm just gonna leave you right here. There you go. Oh, cool. Thanks for the rune. Wasn't even looking for it. Good now, right? All right. Why, it's a fortress. Have you ever been inside? Never. Oh, I have. Oh, they went my invitation. Maddie, don't chase after that. You don't know what's in those buildings. No place is safe anymore. I don't understand. Well, that was easy. Thank you. You shoot into the party. I'm gonna call PS on that. You take in being easy. Shall we go in? Emma insisted we need her out by the curtain. Are you looking forward to the party? No. Invitation, please. Oh, yep. Here you go. Here's my invitation. And I waiting out here. I'm sure she'd like that. Why don't you wait here, as any gentleman would, and we'll go inside and make nasty remarks about Emma Stein. Right this way, sir. Well, we know I'm no gentleman. Wow, so you might I'm surprised they didn't name them. You have to feel sorry for her. She's only here to ask for a handout. She must be desperate. When have the Broyles ever given anything away? Maybe she hopes she'll win the game. Oh, life is so boring. I've done it without guns. Thank you. Look at that mask. Sick bastard. Thank you. Another party game. It was fun for a season, but now? What is it tonight? Yes, which is this. They're Ah. Alright, I need to find her. And then I need to... Okay, I remember how to spare this one at least. Ah. I'm gonna have to sleep dart you, right? I can sleep dart you, right? I remember this is a... Draw. Uh, I'm gonna drop a save here to see if I could spare this guy. Yes. Uh, here's a note. Pendleton? Hmm. What's he got to say to me? I don't know. Pendleton is a gutless lying sack of shit. I hope he's paying you well for this. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'm cold tonight. Hurry up, and let's see what you're made of. Lord Pendleton's representative will select his weapon. The content of honor will take place between this anonymous gentleman acting for the challenger, Lord Trevor Pendleton, and Lord Shaw, the challenged party. You will each turn and proceed to the marked positions and remain facing away from each other as I count down from three. All right. They then turn and fire at Get will. on with it. I'll kill this fool and we can all go back inside. Sorry, my lord. We shall proceed. Stop. Stand right there. Okay. Three. Two. One. All right, we're done. And that's another patron dead. What do we do now? Wait, he's dead? It's lucky we're in. Oh no, demand. he's not dead. I hear the Estermonts pay top coin. No use trying them tonight. Let's see if we can find a little brandy. Let the boils clean up the mess. He's not dead, dude. All he did was knock him out. I'm just gonna put you in the bushes right here. Good night. Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight? Indeed, I believe so. 
Victory crumpet. Alright, so I guess I'm going in. Oh my, Hello. That's really the Boyles hope you have a wonderful time. Mask for you. Thank it's you. Exactly like the wind. Go into the foyer. Careful. We tried for a peek upstairs, and the man on duty is an ass. I should have taught him some manners. This party is a sham. I'm sure he's oh. just doing his job. A party like this, anyone might have crept in. Excuse me, my cousin is a marquee. Oh yeah, I remember these Of course guys. I don't mean you. Put but that away and leave. And the boils are awfully down. wealthy these days. Nonsense. Waverly just hires officers from the watch to impress Ugh, you smell like the streets. Been slumming it, have you? <laughs> a little bit. Did you hear about Mrs. Brimsley? You'll never believe this. What is it now? She had her jobber pick up a boy in the street. There. What can I get for years old? No family hmm. yet. I thought her in. Oh, hello. Welcome to my party. I don't believe you've had the pleasure. All right, that's definitely Welcome not the, the one. You. What, what a deliciously you? sinful mask. Be in any given situation, as I think I've proven. I told you I know not it's to different every There's time. A deal I could Hello, Red. I trust you are on the guest list, so only yeah. So hmm. I saw them, red, white, and black. Now <sighs> There's so many people to Even loot. Said, you should see this as an opportunity. To what? Hold on. I know your mission tonight. We must speak privately. All right. You're the person. This is not at all privately. Stop at once. What are you going to do about I'm it? I'm a friend of Pendleton's, and I've done a few favors for your cause. I know your purpose here tonight, and how to say this, your target is the woman I love. I swear that if you'll bring her to me unharmed, you will never hear of her again. There's a cellar directly below the kitchen. I'll wait for you there. All right. I'm not proud of this, but surely it's better than seeing her killed. Her name is Esma. I won't harm her. Esma. I swear. I'm a man of means. Just bring her to the cellar, and I will keep her safe with me forever. All right. Esma. What color is Esma? <laughs> what is it? I beg your pardon. One sister's in red, one in white, one in black. I'm stumped. My wife thinks we should sneak upstairs to look for clues, but I don't like the looks of those guards. Hmm. I see. This is a, uh... This is a guessing game, I, I recall. That's like part of their little game. You don't know which one's which. I turn it off if I go down there. My servants heard it from hers, naturally. They were sexual rights, I can only assume. Or else, I heard she bathed in her own nephew's blood. Ridiculous. What sort of hygiene is that? It's a ritual for the outsider. Hmm. To keep them safe. Emma, you could get her sent to the Abbey. Nobody that rich gets sent anywhere they don't want. Oh. The Brimsley's made an awful. All right, I have to get up there. Think you'll get your own squad after what happened last night? Yes, of course. Please move along. I might be able to possess one of them by... Hmm. Try and pass her down, I'll get vaporized. Excuse me. Play! Money. No guests past this point. Okay, sorry. <laughs> Sign the guest book. Our sisters in the oracular order make a pronouncement. Corvo. <laughs> yes. Ooh. 
you there, stop. Careful. The Wall of Light is a gift from the Lord Regent, designed to keep his good friends safe. I doubt you qualify. Just uh, hide them all back here real quick. I did nothing. Put it away, sir. How do I put it away? Huh? Oh, no, do I do I really not have any more of those? I thought I had more. How do I Okay, so yeah, I am out. Is there a button to are. put my weapon away. Oh, at this state. Who invited you? You're you a scandal in that mask. I, I like a man everyone. with poor judgment. Would you get me a drink? I'd be so grateful. Oh. Come and entertain me. Fine. A drink. All right. Hmm. <coughs> That's a lot of cider. <laughs> Enjoying yourself? Let me throw it. Let me throw it. I love that mark on the back of your hand. Thank you so much. Now, how can I thank you? Are you playing Lady Boyle's guessing game? Yeah. Well, I know for a fact that Waverly's in white tonight. Perhaps she's pretending to be a virgin. Additionally, Lydia's in black. So it's red. The answer is red. I'm sure in a few drinks I'll find that mask funny. Oh. Hello, handsome. Hello. Uh, I think I know your name. Really? Who am I then? Esma, right? In the flesh. Now, do you know what my sisters are wearing? Oh. Silly, she's wearing white tonight. <laughs> oh my word, I wasn't supposed to say, was I? Lydia and Waverly will be so furious. This is exactly what they said would happen. I'm sorry I got you in trouble. Oh, don't stop now. This is so thrilling. Come with me. What? Okay then. Ooh, scary night. Okay. Don't know why, but. Let's go. Now where have my friends gone? Oh, there you are. Bye. You know, I have a dirty little secret. You can't imagine who I'm seeing. I mean, if people only knew, but I'm only doing it to ensure the family name. It's too dangerous right now not to have proper connections. Okay. Truthfully, if I could get free of him, I would. You're more my type. Mysterious, silent, self-composed. I do believe this is going to be a fabulous evening. 
Ooh, painting. Well, here we are. What shall we do with ourselves? It's sleep time. <laughs> Good night. All right, I'm gonna go loot the rest of your building real quick. Never mind. Um. Huh, Esmo was in right. It wasn't red. Interesting. We'll never notice. No. Oh. Alright, I guess we'll take the easy way down. First, I might as well just check. Is there a rune all the way down there and cellar boats down there? Don't really need any more runes. So, I guess I'll just be going. We take that too. Alright, guess we're good. Quick little teleport, and there's a blood stain on the ground. You just wait right there. I'll come back. Don't worry. Damn, missed. Nope, you go to sleep. Everybody go to sleep. Ah. Ah. Eat all my food. Someone talk? I thought I heard someone. Alright then. Time to continue on my path. Come with me, Lady Red. There you go. You found her. Quickly, let's get her on board. All right. At last. Oh, my love. Someday you will understand. You'll never know how happy you've made me. Someday she'll learn to appreciate me. After all, she'll have her whole life. Have fun with the honeymoon. They're gonna have a happy life. Oh, that goes to the sewers? Alright. I might as well go back up and try and loot the rest of the party real quick. Okay then, I guess I won't be looting the rest of the party. Money. Huh. Nasty. Not getting out that way. I 
guess I'll be turning this. What am I supposed to do? Ah, gee, piranhas. Alright. They rose the... or lowered the gate, so now I can't get out as easily. That shouldn't affect me too badly. Yeah, I can just hop right over. Hi! Alright, Samuel, let's go! I hope you enjoyed your evening, sir. But we'd best be on our way. Quickly. Alright, let's go. Hostile killed, zero. Civilians killed, zero. Alarms rung, zero. I was detected, sadly. Took a painting. Yeah. Didn't kill anyone. I feel good about this. Hmm. Lord Pendleton said he would meet us here. I checked the wine cellar. Losing family gives a man a thirst. All right. Lord Pendleton! I trust you enjoy. You did it. And now we've done away with a woman and a noble woman at that. But Boyle was a viper. She helped the Lord Regent kill the Empress. So I don't feel a thing for her. Personally, I heard you upheld my name in a rather spectacular style, and that's yeah. a risk to yourself. I want to thank you for it. This little item has been helpful to my family over the generations. But I think you'll find more use for it than I ever will. Go on. The guy's not dead, by the way, so... You've had a long night, Corvo, but I fear it's not over. Havelock and Martin have already cooked up something more for you. They would like to see you now, in Havelock's chambers above the bar. Ooh, free room. Thank you, I guess. Attention, Dunwall citizens. The streets adjacent to Boyle Manor remain off-limits pending an ongoing investigation. All right, I guess this is where I'm going to leave it off. I still haven't killed anyone. Nice, so the pacifist run is actually doing well for now. So anyways, like, subscribe, all that stuff. This is Agent Owen, signing off.